Wish my brother Yemi happy birthday. As you are celebrating 50 today, I pray you will celebrate many, many more years in the name of Jesus. Amen. This is to wish uh, Yemi a happy 50th birthday. I wish you many, many more years in good health in abundance of prosperity and you will see your children's children in the mighty name of Jesus. Happy birthday my brother. That's my brother from ATL. 
Royemo, I wish you all the best. Happy birthday to you. You know you are so wonderful and you are a person that everybody loves. You've been there for everybody. That is why we all flew down here to celebrate you. Happy 50th birthday and welcome to the club. Welcome to the fifth floor. We all love you from the Orekoya family. Much love, bro.
I'm so excited to be here. I'm excited to be here with the family to celebrate my amazing husband. I just want to wish him a very, very happy birthday. 50th is a very great milestone. We're going to celebrate many more years together till it, all his teeth fall out. I'm so happy and I pray everything goes great and we all return home safe with you, God. Thank you. Thank you so much. I want to go ahead to say a big thank you to all our friends, especially the ones that came with us from our several part of the world. We want to say all thank, a big thank you to our family members for being patient with us, for you know just cheering us on through this, gearing up to this birthday celebration. So we want to say a big thank you to everyone for coming. We wish everybody right, a safe delivery, a, a safe trip back home, and uh, let's all have a good time. Let's have fun. And today is like the most exciting day, you know, in my entire life. Uh, for the first time, I'll be celebrating my life, myself, you know, as a person. And I'm just very excited. Uh, I cannot, you know, start to, to talk about what, you know, the Almighty God has done for me. Uh, I am very grateful. I'm very excited. And also, I mean, when I look around and I look at, you know, everyone around me here, yeah, I don't know what I've done, you know, from, for everyone to be here today. Uh, from UK, from US, from Canada. Uh, and I'm just very grateful. I'm just very happy. I'm extremely happy. I'm short of words. And, and I just don't, I don't know what to say. I'm just short of words. Uh, I, can, I can be here and begin to talk about this until tomorrow. But most importantly, I give God all the glory. I give God all the adoration. And I just want to say, you know, thank you, Lord. Thank you for my wife, uh, for my for my family, for my girls, for my mom, for my aunt sitting by my side right here. And I'm just very grateful. I'm very grateful. So thank you. Thank God.
after we have taken our uh, we are going on bread. Everybody has to step in down with one big bunch of horrible. And the beast thing comes to my friend. Mama, I want to appreciate you. Thank you because you are alive today to witness the golden jubilee of my brother. We pray that the Lord will keep you and strengthen you the more. There are so many things I will say about you, but time will not permit me. And um, I remember when he asked to relocate to the United States of America. And after some years, I was privileged to, have, to be a pastor in the same city in Atlanta, Georgia. And Yemi came that day and uh, everybody was like, Pastor, Pastor, Pastor. And this guy stood and said, Oh, anyway, <laughs> is it everybody still enough? Well, me, John, yes, he can be your pastor. This one is my friend. Hey, hey, hey. And um, he's a very jovial person very friendly person. So many things have benefited from him. And I want to pray for you that on this fifth ladder, as you celebrate your golden jubilee, God will take you higher and higher. Greater height, greater level, more achievement, abundance, and many more achievements. I want to celebrate Mama, the princess. Now she has graduated from being a princess to the queen. She's now the queen. Are they me? Are they me? God bless you for taking good care of my brother and my friend. I think I still have one or two people that will still talk. So don't let me finish all things. But Jeremy is a man that you can relate with and you will never regret it. Over three decades, the friendship is still going solid. I thank God for that friendship. Thank you for this privilege. God will honor you. You are still my brother. You are still my friend, and you are still my confidant. Thank you. On behalf of the Adeni Joseph, we sincerely want to wish Mr. Adeyemi Adeni a happy golden jubilee, and we pray that the Lord will take him to greater height and greater level. This fifth ladder that he has climbed today, by the grace of God, he will get to the sixth, seventh, eighth, and ninth. And if God tarries in his coming, we trust God that we will be celebrating 1 and 20 together. We want to wish him happy birthday, long life and prosperity. Thank you. I wish him all the best that life has to offer. I pray that from henceforth, I mean lines will begin to fall onto him in pleasant places. Many happy returns of the 5th of July. In the name of God the Father, in the name of God the Son, and in the name of God the Holy Spirit. Si <laughs> I don't know if you are a good boy. Ben, Maria, she or Guri. Do she? Happy birthday to you. Uh, Yemi Adeniyi. Um, we love you. Um, I wish you more, more years to come to celebrate in good health and in prosperity. Thank you for having us. Let's have a good time. Thank you so much. He has been there for us all the time. I'm so happy for him. I thank God for this day. And if he came to us, then go for everything. <laughs> thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I wish you many more years on the land of the living in good health. By the special grace of God. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you all. Let's 
Moseba, O Birinle Moseba, O Nunu Moseba, O Mawa Moseba, and yet the King Ma, we send you all Nifaya. Second Ma, we saw our Nimu Makoni, a lot of pictures of the Vilo, or Nyakola, nobody can see more Kokoni. I are a lot of baby, the lady, you know, you want my money, terms of today in the name of Jesus I am so happy for you thank you for the fifth floor I on behalf of myself my husband um, Bishop Duradi Deji and my children were saying happy birthday and many happy returns may the Lord bless you and we love you so much here. may God bless you and on behalf of all of us that are present here and some of us that could not make it will say happy birthday to you, brother. You can make that applause better and louder. Thank you so very much, sir. Next up. My, my, my brother, it's not my friend, though. It's my brother. We were all born and raised on the same street. I've known Yemi for, I would say, for 50 years. He's 50 today, 
and I would say I've known him for that long. Very good guy, very good man. Um, I remember when he used to work at Radio Sag. My uncle doesn't know this. My uncle has a house at Oloje. Uh, Papa Chao. We are about 15 guys living in that house. My uncle doesn't know he was in London. He was like, okay, yeah, you guys say, well, okay, you say, well, okay. Yeah, me feed everybody every day. Every day, every day. He will go to work, he will come back. If he doesn't come back from work, we don't eat. That's how good this guy is. Um, an awesome guy, great guy. That's for me, for me I'm a, my whole family to be here today. It's just because of him. That's how good he is. He's not a friend to me, he's my brother. I remember when I went to the United States, I said, you, you coming to join me? He said, yes. And I think about a year or two later, he came and joined me. And we've been there together. If I don't call him, he will pick up the phone and call me. He will say, Baba, oh, we win our money. I'm sorry, Baba. He will still call me, you know. Great guy, great guy. This is my brother, this is not my friend. And he said, my brother, I love him to death. I love him, I love him, I love him. And I will do anything for Yemi. Yemi will do anything for me. I have a lot to say, but I don't want to keep us waiting because I'm late. I'm sorry about that. I missed my flight in Cairo. I was supposed to be here yesterday, but I, you know, I'm here now. So I don't want to keep us waiting. I want us to, you know, just to continue to marry and to, you know, celebrate with Yemi. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, and thank you so much. Thank you. Talk and talk about him, but because I do not want to belabor the hour, I'll just mention one more quality of this brother called Yemi. I recall a few years ago when a family member was sick back in Atlanta, and then we were requested we were we need to be in the hospital for so so many weeks. Throughout this period, Yemi took pity watch of work to sleep on the floor with me day and night for almost three weeks until we were discharged. Jeremy, as you celebrate these golden years, so shall you do 60, in the name of Jesus, so shall you do 70, so shall you do 80, 90, you will see your children, children. I celebrate you, my brother, and you know I love you so much. Love you so much. Thank you, Jeremy, for all you do. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, please arrive. Okay. What about Mr. Yomi and your dog? Is he present now? All right. Even when I was the final year, he still in fact. His contribution to my success is, is, is uncountable. It's not something you can. So I just want to say, because I don't know what to say again, I have to say, you are just starting afresh. You are starting afresh in a way that no man can determine your height in life in the name of Jesus. Please, I want, to, I want us to use this opportunity because honestly, if I begin to say anything from now, I may not end it like I said earlier on. Yemi is a man who has been able to dedicate his spare time to the service of God and humanity. And that's why you can see that it's obvious today that we are here to celebrate him. Like I said, it's a phenomenon. And God will take him above his own expectation in life in the name of Jesus. Yemi, we love you dearly. God bless you.
is very dedicated to anything you put his mind to. Whether it's work, whether it's family, whether it's friends. If you say he's in the corner, trust me, you have to look back. He's got you. That's what he is. And I like the fact that he's very strong and very direct as well. He's a no nonsense kind of guy. I know a lot of people have said that he's kind, he's dead. But you see, it's what you get as well with him also. Don't, don't take his kindness for foolishness, you know? And I like that. It just makes you know where you stand with him. So from the day I met him, I didn't have to think of, would this guy have my back or not? I just knew. And he has been consistent with friends, with family, with the pain we I just like the way he treats people with respect, you know? And I just pray to God Almighty Father that this day will just be like a landmark of something great, something new, something, you know, you know that it's worthy of being celebrated because that's the kind of person it is. It should be celebrated every day. And I love the way he's been such a fantastic guy. The kids, oh my goodness, if they don't see him, once they see him like this, like, I'm not existed in life. I'm like, okay, I've been here, oh, all of a sudden, he's daddy, you know? So, thanks again to everyone that, you know, testifying to, not just testifying, but also recognizing who he is. Because a lot of people, so some people don't appreciate that. And it's, it's, it's a testament to, again, the kind of people that he draws, the person that he around him. So, um, let's all continue to have a good time. And uh, thank you, my amazing husband. I love you very much. Thank you.